everyone. It is a fine, fine evening in the Terraria world. As you can see, it is 6 p.m., so it actually is evening for once. I finally got it right for once. As you can see, I have decided that we need to change the look of the base. It looks kind of ugly. I'm not good at design, but we're, we're trying to figure this out. As you can see, I've already started. I really like what's going on here and here. I'm going to see if I can continue to make it look kind of decent, and we'll go from there. By the way, I completed that slime raid event, and I did die another time right as I ended the recording the other time. So, yeah, there's another death. But anyways, I will get back to this and I will let you know how, where we are. Is that all of them? 68 more stars? Okay, bet. Oh, there we go. Nice. 69. Now it's perfect. Fact though. So we've got kind of like this weird pattern going. I know it looks kind of stupid, but I don't know. I was trying to be a little quirky with it. So we're going to make another little house here and we're going to make this the greenhouse. So that's the plan. I think I'm going to go like this. Where's that station at? Where's the where's the the heavy duty workbench? Yeah, the heavy workbench. I need this thing for a sec because I can make crazy stone out of this, right? Yeah, stone stone slabs. Give me some of these. Traveling merchant has arrived. Is it actually a traveling merchant or is it still Willie? Yeah, he's still down there. Huh? Oh whoa whoa! There's two of them. Look, what? there's a traveling merchant here and there's a traveling what? merchant here. Damn. So that traveling merchant is full on just bugged. I got two traveling merchants in my in my world currently. Dude, how many freaking rings? Money collector, duality. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. DPS meter, I have one of those. That's not useful. Dude, I gotta go get granite, bro. Isn't there like a granite biome like right here? I'm pretty sure. Isn't there? No. Um, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. I know. You know what? I, or I do know there is a granite biome though. You know where I do know there is a granite biome? Where are you going? If we come over here. And then we go to this area, then we can find a granite biome at this one. Oh, we can also find a, another strange plant on the way that I can't pick up. You know what? Screw the banners. They don't matter. Actually, that banner looks good. I like that one. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I actually ended up picking the wrong elevator, but it's okay because as you can see, we're at a granite biome anyway, so it don't matter. Okay, we got 151 granite blocks now. Ebon stone brick wall. So what is this gonna be? Um, hmm, I don't even know. I think I might make it another level tall though. We're gonna come like this and then back out and then up again. So boom, 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 boom. No, boom, boom, like that. Oh, what the fuck? Fuck up, fuck up, fuck up, fuck up. What the fuck? Okay, this is looking good, people. This is looking good. I'm liking it. We got kind of like a wonky, janky, old setup vibe going. It kind of looks like a blacksmith shop, so I'm deciding what I'm going to put in here. It might... Oh, I'm all out of the things. Traveling merchant has departed. That's okay, bro. I don't care about you currently. More Evanstone. Oh, that's it. That's all my Evanstone brick. Good thing that's all I need. Okay. What's gonna go in here is you may ask. That's the thing. I really don't know. I could put chests in here. In fact, I was thinking about it honestly, so I might just do that. Yo, 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 yo. Is this thing bigger on one side than the other? How? How? How could it possibly be bigger? Oh, I see, I see. There we go. Does that look better? I think that's now centered properly. Now I just gotta make my things again. I want to die. I'm gonna be honest, most of this video, I'm, I'm literally gonna spend this entire video redoing the base. <gasps> so, don't expect much from this, people. This is just a base renewal video. <gasps> Actually, I'm gonna go get a drink right now while I collect some stars. <gasps> what the hell, dude? It just put me into blocks. That was so weird. It just forced me into Narnia. Okay, I hope that's right, because if not, it looks really janky. Where's my obsidian? Whoa, why did you put everything in here? Bruh. Yo, those demon torches changed color crazily. Look at that. As you can see, people. Oh, look at that Fortnite just finished. Come on, kill me, I'm here. Yes, people. I want to play Lego Fortnite after the Terraria series. I'm spoiling it. I'm spoiling it for you guys. We're playing Lego Fortnite after Terraria series. I I'm, I'm not a big Fortnite player, but this Lego Fortnite looks like so much fun. I have to give it a go and we're going to do it on the channel. We're going to do it together. Fresh start, fresh beginning. No idea what I'm doing. Let's put it this way. The last time I played Fortnite, it was still season one.
of the first ever battle royale like the first time it came out season one i played like five games never since then yeah let's get back to the base this is taking a while i'm not gonna lie i still don't really know what to do over here but i'm slowly moving everything over here we have weapons down here accessories up here haven't put anything nothing for these two quite yet this one is for blocks over here the one next to it is for the stuff that i make from the blocks so that they don't mash up as you can tell from the water chest it's the fishing chest which let's open up these two real quick since we're in hard mode and nothing too great but i can go like this and get rid of most of it so that's awesome and right next to this with the mushy chest we have miscellaneous junk that i just never really know where to put so we're putting it all in there if we come up here we have an evil chest and we have have a magic chest i know that yeah, i could just put them both in the same thing as mob loot but as you get farther in it starts to become a little crazy and the chest starts overflowing over here we have potions and then over here we have animals and food buffs so yeah good stuff good stuff and then i got the two boss things oh guide what are you doing down here bro bro i don't really know what this tube is it was kind of just a way to get like to and from both of them i have an idea for the farm i think i'm gonna keep it over here but i'm not too sure yet so we'll find out and i also want to add like another layer to this base maybe a couple honestly um i may do a lot of off camera but who knows maybe we'll just keep going past our hour mark i mean to be honest I i'm pretty much not saying anything and just building so i'm gonna make this top gold chest ingots oh whoa 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 if you really want to screw someone up fuck up there today call them an ingot that that's how you get to someone that's it's like calling them a nerd and then the one below we're gonna call ores so there we go now we, now we've got an ingots and ores chest too yeah get out of here bro you ain't hot stuff you ain't hot stuff for shite for shiza get out of here get play out of here so we've got a plant matter chest that I don't know what to do with quite yet, a stations chest along with all the stations that I still don't have a spot for, and then a summons chest. So we can take these two out though, that won't be fine and dandy. Go put that in the miscellaneous junk. Oh, not the mushy. Um, the arrows. Yeah, all the arrows. All of the ammo. Um, I'm gonna be honest people, I might switch to a melee ranged build for the rest of this game. We'll see, we'll see okay um let's see what else could we do we can make this all a little bit less chaotic now bring our station buffs here so my question is can i take the piggy bank i can't place it on the anvil damn we could go like this just place them up there and then we can come place the crystal ball on the table I i'm liking this base onion baby what do you think what do you think of this base do you like it do you like it you're wagging your tail, you must like it. It's gotta be a good base if she's wagging her tail. Oh, look at that. We've actually got enough of a desert biome for scorpions to spawn, so that's actually pretty cool. I mean, like, I have a little bit more room. I was thinking maybe I could make this actually my building room, but then what am I gonna use all of this space over here for? Damn, I'm really struggling here. I'm really struggling to think of what I could do. When it comes to just like interior design, I'm not too great at that. I'm going to be honest. Like I'm struggling enough with like the outer design. As you can see, like I'm not the best. I'm not the best. You know, originally before I actually decided building all this, I was going to make this tube coming through this side and then I was going to make another tube coming out the other side identical. But now I don't really know what I would end up using this for. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. Terra fart cart. Terra toilet? Seriously, this is what you use the broken hero sword for? Terra toilet. Oh my god, I was just looking up a terrarium. I don't want a terra toilet. I might have to make that. <laughs> Ooh, be so perfect. Ah. I just got what I was actually looking for. Holy crap, that was crazy. Um, that never happens. That never happens. Diamond bunny cage. Is it too big? Damn, it's just barely off center. That's the thing I'm not liking about it. Okay, so change of plans. Bam! Diamond bunny cage. Look at that. That's beautiful. I love it. I love it. Diamond bunny cage. Diamond. Yeah, you see you guys over here? This is your divine partner. This is your divine counterpart. Okay? We also got a sapphire bunny, so let's just... So let's take the Tinker's Workshop. Let's put this here, along with the sawmill right next to it. And then look at that. Look, the heavy workbench sits right next to the loom. So now, if I need anything of these sorts, I can just come in here and grab it. Most of my crafting will be done in here. But now that now that you mention it, although arguably now you mention it, actually, if I'm going to be doing something like this, let's just come do this instead. 
So there we go. Now we have the anvil and the forge in here instead. I, I like the furnace. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep the campfire. Everything else is also going to stay. L once again, nothing's truly centered. So maybe we'll put it like right here hmm. in between. I like that. I like that a little bit. Oh, Traveling merchant has departed. When did he get here? I had no idea that he was here. If I would have known he was here, I would have gone and said hi, but I, I didn't know he was here. So what are we thinking of this people? How, how do we like this? I think this looks much better. I think it looks much better. I really like it. I really do. I think I might change up the top. And then if I'm being honest, I think we're going to call it there off camera. I'll try and figure out this side over here because this side is just a mess. Like I, it's too big. I think I just don't need any of this anymore. That means I can use this space and probably cut this down to here. From here down, I don't really need any more, which kind of sucks, but whatever. I like how the base is going though. So let me fix this top part and then we will call it there. There we go. Look at him. Look at the little homie now. Doesn't he look like a little alien? I think that looks good. I think we're going to call it there, people. That was a dandy, quite dandy episode of Terraria, if I do say so myself. I don't know how it could get any better than that, if I'm being honest. Beautiful. So everyone, that was the uh, designer build of Terraria Expert Mode. Like, I never thought I'd ever make something like this, but it's looking good. It's looking dandy. I might do some more off camera. Well, I am going to do some more off camera, at least to fill in this bottom part, because I want this to be cut in half so that I'm more motivated to work on the rest. But after that, I'm probably just going to destroy everything in here probably keep this top half and then just work on it and see what i can get i'm really liking this area over here it looks splendid here we'll do these granite lanterns instead these ones are different dude i hate that i'm telling you the the knockback from the dash of the shield of cthulhu drives me bonkers there we go how does that look it's got a little bit more light on the outside i think it looks good for some reason in terraria the only thing i know how to do is like a asian style buildings just anything else I really struggle with. I just, I'm not good with non-symmetrical builds, okay? Non-symmetrical is not my forte, so. In fact, actually, I think I just realized something too. You, homie, would actually probably look really good over here. Huh, yeah, that actually don't look too bad. That don't look too bad. I'm liking that. I like the water. I like adding a little bit of water. I wish the guide would figure out his shit, but why would that happen? And in here, inside here, I didn't know this would work, but there's like a little lip right here that you can come down into, and I like that a lot too. That was the good episode. I hope you all enjoyed this one, people, because this one was a lot of fun. Recorded for not way longer, but a bit longer trying to make this base look good. I hope this video turns out good because we really didn't do anything, but yeah. Make sure to go check out my Christmas special, teaching my dad how to play PVZ Garden Warfare 2. That was a good video. I will keep that at the end card for my character review video. And if you want to see more Let's Play series, then you know it, it is at the end of the video. So please go check those out. I hope you all enjoyed the video, people, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Peace out.